Merrill's a team that a lot of other people figured would contend for a conference championship, and they've looked really good recently. Yeah, they did. Um, I had them as my preseason pick to win the conference. They had, I believe, 18 returning starters. They have a whole handful of kids that were all conference members last year. I, I, right after the season last year, this, this was the team that I thought would be tops in our conference, and they very well could by the end of the season. They do have one conference loss to Medford, uh, a game that they very easily could have won, and um, they're just as good as they get. They're, it's, it's just going to be another tough team that we're going to face. Their ground game has really looked impressive, haven't they? Yeah, it is. Their, their quarterback, um, he's the most dynamic player with the football in his hands of anybody in our conference. Um, you know, it seems every week we're going against a stud like that, but this kid, is he's the real deal. Um, and to make things even worse, they have a fullback who's just a, a meat grinder of a runner. Um, they got an excellent wide receiver, a big offensive line. Yeah, they can move the ball. The guys get a chance to come home and play at Weichel Field again. What does this mean to a team that's really had to kind of learn on the fly? Yeah, well, you know, it's second to last home game for our seniors, and, you know, they're getting a little emotional about it. We were talking about it in practice this week, and, you know, they're, they're ready to go. It's, it's always nice to be at home. We love playing at home. Uh, the, the kids love it. Our players love it when the fans come out and watch them. You know, they're families and, you know, community members and classmates, and they get really jacked up for it. And we just, there's, there's nothing like playing at home here in Ashland.